What's good y'all, Son here with another YouTube video. Just a heads up, today's video is sponsored by none other than DistroKid. Shout out to DistroKid, more on them later. Today, we are talking about the brand new Play Series plugin from Native Instruments for Contact 7, Kareem Riggins. I can't believe that this happened. I'm truly excited. I explored some of the sounds really quick. I didn't want to go too far into it just so I can still be inspired using it during this video. But y'all, unreal drum sounds. I mean, unreal loops that are built into it. Let's just get straight into this and make a quick beat and explore what this plugin has to offer. So let's go. First of all, the interface is amazing. This looks so beautiful. The design is amazing. I'm not entirely sure who actually designed this artwork that goes with it, but damn, it's nice. And just these pads, I mean, looks too dope. So let's just get right into it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just mess around with some sounds and and see what we got. So so far. Like that on the kick. I love the velocity because it's like. Kind of got that, that ride in the background or something. Ooh, what's that noise? Noise. 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 In your noise. Oh, it's on there. Nice. I like that. I think I like dirt. Hmm. Okay. And then straight up. Okay. Everything's pretty editable in here, obviously, and exchange any sounds you want from there. But, okay, because I like this kit and I had it open. And then I had another one open that I was messing around with earlier that I was like. And let's hear what loops are in here. Dude, Kareem is a legend. <laughs> if y'all aren't familiar with Kareem Riggins, you should get familiar now because um, dude's played on probably so many of your favorite records from jazz to hip hop with Dilla. The dude's got such a deep rooted history in, in drumming and production. Yeah. Let's give him his flowers all day. Kareem Riggins. Head nod sweet. Come on. I, I've got that on vinyl and that, that is a, a regular, regular rotation for me. Okay. Let's try something. Let's go 90. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. I wonder if that loop actually is locked. Okay. 
Okay, so I'm going to maybe track some automation. Freeze this one real quick and just fade those little in a quick 35 minute beat here. Well, the video is going to be much shorter than this. Up all night making beats a slap. <laughs> Dcat, what a G. And now. Let's take a second to hear from our sponsors, DistroKid. Man, I'm such a fan of DistroKid. The amount of support they show me and other producers on this platform and others is absolutely next level. Today, we're doing a quick little pass through on what hyperfollow is, why it's so important. When you've gone through the process, and if you haven't seen the process or don't know what the process of uploading your music is like, Check out one of my previous videos where I talk about how to actually go about uploading your music and then hyperfollow. To me, this is one of those extremely important and free ways of getting more people to hear your music on your release day. Not enough people use this tool. I, I've been using it for years, but only recently have I been using it actively, like really pushing it. So when we click this song, end of the day, and if y'all don't know, it drops this Friday, February 17th. When you have your track fully uploaded, you will get this link here. 
And when you click it, you can either go share on Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, Pinterest. They have the embedded links here, but you can also just click visit and it's exactly what it is called. Wow. It's a pre-save link. So if you hit the link in my description and you go and pre-save this, if you're on Spotify, this is only for Spotify. What that means is you'll be notified the day this song comes out, you'll be one of the first to be notified. And for me, as the musician, the artist who's putting the music out, it'll give me a much greater chance of the powers that be within the Spotify ecosystem algorithm, <laughs> throwing all these words out. It gives me a much greater chance at landing on an algorithmic playlist or even potentially an editorial playlist because it looks at it and goes, oh, damn, this track's already got 80 pre-saves. That means people are excited and it's not even out yet. So let's try it here and push it to a larger group of people. So the more pre-saves you got, the greater the chance you have of actually getting on some kind of a playlist, whether it be editorial or algorithmic, as far as like, you know, smaller playlists and whatever it might be. But this link is so important and it's as easy as just clicking copy, save. Where do we want to post it? Let's go. Twitter. Am I logged in on my Twitter here? Yes, I am. What's happened? Let's go. Oh, I see Z posted a little loop there. Um, Zilly active, eh? Okay. What's happening? One of my favorite tracks, favorite with a U. Trax is dropping this Friday, February 17th. Do me a solid and pre-save it if you got Spotify. And then I go like this, post the link. I might even at Spotify Canada, see if they show me some love. They never do, but you never know. You got to try. And boom, I'm going to hit enter. Okay, one of my favorite tracks is dropping this Friday, February 17th. Do me a solid and pre-save it if you've got Spotify. Oop. <laughs> boom. Where does it go? Exactly where I was talking about. Bing, bang, boom, pow. That's what's up. Once again, shout outs, DistroKid. All love. All love. Let's get back to the music right now. Okay, dope. So, y'all... I got into creative zone there. Um, I haven't made a beat in over a week, which is really wild. Um, but ended up with a little bit of an idea here that I know I can come back to and vibe with. Shout outs Native Instruments, man. Amazing plugin. Kareem Riggins, one of my favorite producers and drummers. I'm so grateful that this plugin exists now. Y'all, I will drop a link in the description. If you feel like purchasing it, use my affiliate link. It helps this channel out. It helps me continue to do what I do as a producer and a content creator. That's it, man. Let's listen through and wrap it up. All right, come on. Thank you. 